All right, guys, I'm back. It's been a couple of hours, and everybody has different ways of doing it. So, going through here, um, bronze seems to be a hundred, hundred more than iron. To make bronze, we need copper and tin, um, which currently I'm just waiting for a creeper to come up and kill me. Uh, we have a bunch of copper. Problem is, is we have it in liquid form. And that's a big problem. We have a set amount of tin that could do the job. Uh, but again, like I said before, we have a problem with maybe it not crossing over and maybe it does. I don't know 100%. Um, so what we're going to have to wind up doing for the time being, and unfortunately... I don't, I, do I have enough to make a, another cast? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on here, hold on. Oh, I lost all that stuff too. Um, there's a basin we can make for copper. Um, and if we are smart, um, is that enough? We might have enough. Yeah, we do have enough. Actually, we can put that back. They can make a uh, casting basin. Ooh, I can make it right here. Uh, and it just goes like this. Ta-da! And this is kind of nifty. Uh, because it actually makes the... Um, damn. I need a pickaxe for that. <sighs> okay, we can make it... Let's just make this pickaxe and be done with it. Alright, so, um, pickaxe, bone, that, and that. Alright, it's not a, a keeper, okay? Because we're going to break this, and we're going to put this down. Now, if we look at how much, is that molten gold? we got two ingots left. I want the copper. We have 18, so it takes nine ingots nine ingots to make a block so that's 918 so that's two two all together is that right yeah that's right and how much does it take to make bronze three copper one tin okay and then you have a there you go copper block Ta -da! copper block all right uh Instead of going through that whole whole motion of having to rip apart or tr to uh, make ingots, you can just turn into blocks. So with that being said, uh, we've got nine ingots left. So we'll just go ahead and do them real quick. That cover? It's from Galactic Core. The shit. Oh no. Don't tell me this is what I think it's going to be. God, I hope not. Go ahead and just drain the rest of it out. Just to be on the safe side. Should be down to two. I'm watching behind me for creepers. Oop, oh, wrong thing, wrong thing. Where'd he go? There it is. Um, I'm going to be... I'm going to have to tell you this point blank. I'm going to be doing a lot of stuff off camera. Uh, because I just don't have the capacity to keep doing the speed the speed vo uh, videos. Um, and to be truthful with you, I know some of you guys are getting don't like a lot of them. Uh, but uh, ideally I would like to get a slime farm going. Um, apparently that's important. Iron. How much iron is in here? Six ingots. Yeah, I better go ahead and dump that iron out too. So all I have left is the blood. And I'm not exactly sure how to get the blood out. I don't know if we can turn it into bars or not. I think there was something in here about that. One iron, one blood, one emerald. Yeah, that's not going to happen. I'm not going to waste emeralds. Oops. Q. 
Okay, one more to go. Thank you for bearing with me, guys. I appreciate it. Blood, see? Blood won't come out. Alright, so, with that being said, we go back in here, and we put... Make sure I got it right. We need... Three copper, one tin. Alright. So, three copper, and one tin. Just have to wait for that to smelt up. And we should get bronze. And then from the bronze, what we're going to do is we're going to make sure I got this right, because I don't want to screw this up. Uh, the bronze, we're going to make a, a pickaxe head with. Then we will put a bone for our our uh, handle which will give us one uh, handle modifier or multiplier and the bronze will give us a 454 uh, durability and added that to the bone gives us 200 durability then we'll take and put um, paper and that will give us plus one to our Molten bronze. Cool. One Indian. Let me go ahead and dump that out real quick, guys. Sorry about this. Uh, Tinker's Construct doubles your um, your ingots if you do them from the raw ore. So that's just something to keep in mind as you uh, as you do this. All right. So we need this, and I need molten bronze. Okay. Go ahead and get our pickaxe. All right, and uh, that's all we need from that right now. We go take a little siesta real quick. I don't want anything creeping up on us. Not anymore. Um, I will be doing a lot more mining. Let me be right back. All right, guys, I am back, and I'm going to make this really short and simple because I've got a computer issue I'm having to deal with. Um, did I just chunk all that? No, I didn't. I left it. Uh, what we're going to wind up having to do is making a bronze pickaxe head, a copper handle, and a bone, um, a, a bone uh, binding. And that will literally give us a 402 durability, a speed of 7, and a mining level of, of uh, redstone. So, plus a reinforced, um, the mining speed's pretty good, in my opinion. So, uh, I did not name it on purpose, because I don't plan on keeping it for too long. Uh, the next item that we will be doing is the matlock, which of course is used for wood, dirt, and t plants. Um, I'm going to be using iron on it, and this will give me the most durability which is 375 that I have available to me. And we're going to call this one Bone... That's the person I'm talking to. Uh, computer issues. Bone... Ho... Ways. Bone ho you wanted it all removed, right? Yes. And there we go. Bone hose away. There we go. And uh, I'm going to go find out the best uh, one for uh, a weapon and the best one for, yeah, just the best one for, because I believe this one can be used to chop down trees. Let me make sure, though. I don't want to be screwy and lie to you. There we go. Yeah, see, so we're chopping down the trees, too. So perfect. Okay, perfect. So that's what I'm going to do. And uh, thanks so much for watching, guys. Likes and comments great. Appreciate it, as always. Do this fun enough for profit. And, uh... Yay! Lots of shit gonna be done off camera. Bye!